and welcome back to Tarkwood! In this episode, we are going to talk to the chicken lady. Let's see here. I, I think the, the, did the layout for this house change? I don't think it did, but I'm unsure. Alright. Now, my... My main goal in this episode is to actually get up board with nails. It's not much, but we really needed to protect ourselves from dogs. I'm not dying to a dog yet again. It's, it's just not happening. There we go. Hello? Yeah, it's sticky with chicken feces and feathers. Yeah, this isn't KFC anymore. What? Oh, no room in inventory. Um... What will we do? What will we do? We can only carry five of these at a time, right? Drop it. Okay? Make that, because we absolutely, positively need a weapon. And make bandages. No. Okay, drop that, too. Make bandages so we can... Yep. Yep. Keep doing it. Pick up, pick up. No room in inventory. Okay. Make another bandage. We really need to sell this stuff, like, right now. I think I'm going to keep the meat on me. Sorry, these, these chickens, man, they, they freak me out. Recipe for antidote and consumable bread. Eh, yeah, yeah. Alright, what's, what, I'm gonna check out your house, chicken lady, I hope you don't mind. Empty bottle and a rag. Alcohol, hmm. Chicken, chicken lady likes a little drinky drink. And the chicken lady. Chicken Lady sounds far too close to Wolfman. Far too close. Hello, Chicken Lady! How are you doing? Yeah, she looks at me with suspicion and holds her chickens close to her. I hope you haven't come for my dreamies, you bastard! Yeah. This is no place for chickens, young man! Alright, now. Show her this dog tag. Yeah. Yeah, it, it's Janik's plate, my brother! Now, where did Janet go? Oh, God. Yeah, that photo. Yeah, that's great. Bring back my boy Janet. Oh, yeah, the violin player is here again. Get the hell up, Milan, you bastard! Oh, man, the violin player. Yeah, well, I'm not hungry. Thank the heavens for our blessed soul. The poor thing is a little sickly lately, but she's got a lot more heart than all of us. It's only thanks to her that we have something to eat these days. I don't think any lady will want you now, but who needs that when there are other things, right? Thanks. Thank you so much. I'm unwanted by everyone. Forever alone. Thank you. Bye, chicken lady. I don't need dating advice from someone who... who I, I don't know. I was going to make a really sick joke there. Something to do with chickens, and I don't know. Let's just move on. There's a violin player. He was right here. Alright, it's starting to get late. Maybe we should move back. Got the mushrooms. Yeah, we gotta get back to our hideout. We'll talk to uh, the stuttering violin player later on. Yeah, we'll just take the wood and the nails. Okay, where's the hideout? Chicken Lady, Southwest. Head Southwest by Southwest, and we're going to make it. Hey, dead body. Okay, nothing. I like how I'm excited to see a dead body. That's how grim things are. Hey, a dead body for me to loot. Just breathe. Just breathe. Not even, not even, not even. Not taking the risk. Could kill the rabbit. Not going to. I can't spend any more time than absolutely necessary outside. We gotta get back to the house. Blockading will have to happen soonish, but... You know, it, it's one of those things... It's one of those things I'm unsure of. Day one, I don't think it's going to be that bad. Okay, we, we, we really need it. Get out of here. No! I do not want what you're selling, Mr. Dog. Alright. Yeah, yeah, we lost him. We lost him. Okay, what's up with all the dogs? No! Okay.
Okay, okay. You know what? Get the fuck out of here, you stupid dog! Alright, we gotta get back to the house or we're going to die. It's really that simple. I don't think I lost my way. I think I'm heading the right direction, but it's getting dark. We've lost. We're gonna die. If we're going to die. I'm lost. I don't know where I'm going. It's dark. Oh my god. Oh my god. Here it is. Burned houses. I went the wrong way. I completely skipped over the hideout and I'm going to die. Okay, well, we're dead. It was good playing. Uh. <laughs> I completely screwed up. Okay, let's look at this really quick. If I go straight, I might run into it. This stupid dog messed with me. Catch your breath. This is the last time you're gonna run, kid. Just go. I don't care what's behind me. Just go. If we get into that house, we're golden. I don't know what happens to you outside. I guess... I honestly don't know. Okay, we just ran over mushrooms. Don't... Stop panicking. Okay. I love the map and how useless it is. It's just literally a hand-drawn map. It's up here. That's where the house is. Right? I can't see anything. Here it is. We found it. Thank the gods. Alright, now that was, that was far too close. Like, honestly. I'm hearing noises that I don't want to hear. Okay, listen. Listen! Yeah, repair the well. Get get that. Get in. Now. Okay. We're safe. We're safe now. Okay, so. Let's, let's recap, shall we? We met the chicken lady. <laughs> We got lost. We murdered a dog. Pretty successful day, don't you? Don't you agree? I I really hope you do because, God, I I, I don't know how dangerous it is outside when it's dark. I, I honestly don't know. I don't think it's a don't starve situation where the darkness just kills you. Yeah, we are poisoned. Uh, I I hope not. I I really hope it's a just a just a completely dark environment where you can't see anything. And you just hear, you just hear the, the sounds of the night. I mean, it's scary enough indoors. I couldn't imagine being out. Oh, man. Oh. I'm very tempted to read ghost stories, but I, I can't think of any off the top of my head. I remember when I was in third grade, there was this book of ghost stories I used to read. I, I, need, I, I swear I still have the book. I need to find it. I used to think it was so scary. I'd probably laugh at it now. Oh, oh! Did, did anyone, anyone, have a cassette with uh, with uh, like a ghost story and sound effects on it? I remember. Oh, it, it was it was always during Halloween. My my siblings would would play that and just scare the hell out of me. I think I was about five or six. And 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 I think in the story, so okay, that's not good. Somebody's bumping against the house. I think it was basically somebody traversing through this haunted house. And they would have sound effects. Chains, you know, bumping into things. The sound of slamming doors and all that. It would scare the absolute hell out of me. I don't think I have that good set, though. Gonna have to do some Googling. Halloween tapes from the 90s. Oh, boy. Well, the dogs are out. Who let the dogs out? I'm gonna have to murder all of them with my trusty spiky board. Spiky board of doom. Okay. Burn houses. So I wonder if that's a natural fire or somebody set set the place just just on fire because they had infected in there. Certainly wouldn't put it past them. It's taking a while. It's night. I really want to start cooking. Let's start cooking. And inject all that stuff in me. 
so we can so we can level up because I'm pretty sure if you don't level up you're going to end up dying I think the world gets progressively harder I think I don't actually know all I do is get lost and have dogs maul me to death alright I think I think the night's almost over I, I, I'm in this situation where I just want to open the door nope oh, just kidding <laughs> just kidding Watch a dog just be like, rrr, 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 just, just, just pounding at this door now that I opened it. That would scare the hell out of me. I'd be traumatized for life. Very quiet. First night is always easy, I suppose. That's fine. Uh, you just, you just sit back and, and think about how everyone's dead. Okay, here we go. New day. A new day, a new opportunity for terrible things to happen. Mushroom remains. Can we grow the mushrooms indoors? Let's start cooking. 50. Yeah, 30. And what do we get? I'm going to go with animals are less aggressive toward you. Because I'm getting hit by dogs. I don't know if that's optimal, but eh, I'm going to try. Uh, only 130. Should have counted. Ooh, yeah. Gasoline. Can't cook gasoline, though. I'm unsure if that stuff saves. It probably doesn't, and I'm a moron. Okay. Now, what what do we do? Do we board up the house? Let's look at our inventory really quick. What do we have? We have 12 and 24. I think that calls that calls for some boarding up. Barricade the window. 3 and 7. Sounds perfectly acceptable. Yeah, attract all those those terrible things. I really attempted to repair the doorway too, but that's so many nails. So many nails. Gonna drag this. Gonna do our thing that we did last time. I think this is the safest room. It has no windows, they can't see me. I think it's safe. And we're gonna kinda have issues dragging this. Let's do that and then do that. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, we're moving furniture. Always exciting to watch. Yeah, that's a little that's a little buggy. It's a little silly right there. Alright. Stop dragging. I think Alpha 1.3 is coming out soon, so this save's going to be gone. So don't don't get too attached. Hell, I could be dead in five minutes. Alright. Now. What do we do? I'm thinking... I'm thinking we go south. Explore the south. See what's going on. See what's shaking. I really want an axe. An axe would be adorable. Adorable? Who would describe an axe as adorable? That's, that's a twisted mind right there. But an axe would be lovely. Quite lovely to have. Can you chop down trees? I don't think you can. Chopping down trees for wood would be certainly interesting. I'll tell you that much. Oh, okay, so the trees are blocking our path here. Or, or are they? Cabbage Patch Kids? I haven't noted any yet, but... Certainly soon enough. Oh, a corpse. How lovely. Yeah. Oh! Oh, Cabbage Patch Kid! That's... Oh, that was a corpse. No, Cabbage Patch. No, thank you. No, thank you. Nope. 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 No, no, no. Okay. Large mushrooms. Found the rocks. Alright. This... This is not what you want to see. I don't like this at all. Okay. You know what? Can I lure him? Ah! Alright, it's cool. It's cool, man. So, I'm unsure if th those are just feral beings. The plague just didn't kill them. It just drove them insane. That's my guess. Oh. So, those are kind of the, quote, zombies. They really seem more like tribal natives or something. Like, very... Very 
primitive and just protective, defensive of their land. So that's interesting. Maybe it just, uh, maybe the plague can, can bring you to a much more primitive and barbaric state. That would be interesting. Alright, you know what? I think I'm going to end it here in the middle of the woods. If you uh, if you enjoyed this episode and, and read ghost stories as a kid, and if you have any idea about that tape from the 90s, please give me a like and subscribe, and I hope to see you in the next episode of Darkwood!